Welcome back everyone. Sorry about the sound before. These uh, harpies are attacking the workers. So, I'll see what I can do to get them out of here. Okay, harp is driven away. Hello, Mina. Hello, Foreman. Got a minute. I'm in over my head here. I could use some help. Fancy taking down a few harpies or helping out around them. What about the harpies? We just got rid of them. They nest on top of the dam. If they stay there, I'd have no problem. But the stupid buzzards fly down and scare my workers. If you see any harpies, get rid of them. Alright, so let's help this guy out here. Hey, good to see you. How you been holding up? <laughs> Let me browse your wares and I'll tell you. An excellent idea. I have some interesting items today. Let's see. A harpy feather. An accessory. So here's the thing. You can have lots of harpies. Or we can finish this dam. But I don't think you can have both. Alright. Thank you. Now, on our last video, we helped a lady who made uh, apple pies. And we got one from her. And we're still under the effects of that for another 30 seconds. But from doing the crafting, I also have.
several other things and we're gonna use here some sharpening stones and I'm gonna eat some bowls of Ascalonian salad yum 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 hello fisherman Travis hey Do you have a moment I might Billy what's up nice to see you okay my brother said this was a dangerous job but I had no idea it was this bad Drake hatchlings get caught in crawfish traps constantly and they sure are mad when you let them out the scale in the river don't help either is there anything I can do well you could inspect the crawfish cages in the river if you get anything dangerous crawled inside uh, and anything you can do to quell the drake and scale population would be a big help well since I'm clad in armor I do not do uh, things I uh, but I will help with killing the drakes now Billy here is a little bit impatient so let's see what Billy wants may Malandru guide you Hey, yeah, you look pretty smart. We, n you, we know everything there is to know about Destiny's Edge. Come prove that you know as much as we do if you think you can. Well, at this point, I don't know who Destiny's Edge is. So, Destiny's Edge, who are they? Have you been sleeping all your life? Destiny's Edge is the greatest guild in all of Tyria. Take our quiz. You'll learn a lot. Some other time, okay, we'll not be doing that because at this time we have not yet learned about Destiny's Edge. Okay, here's a drake. Drake's over here. Come on, Drake. Let me challenge here. <laughs> oh. Drake. a letter here thanks for your help at the dam I haven't spotted so much as a leak since you came through here if you ever get tired of the hero business come on down my work crew could use skills such as yours yeah you're welcome but I don't think so wonder if this trait counts Dust. No, 
come on. Poor Billy, you know, I wish I could help him out. But I'm new to this area. I'm new to these lands, I haven't learned enough yet. This is my uh, first day out. Well, the population of drakes. Here we are. More drakes. Thunder Blades and my favorite skills. All right, fishermen, we should be all set up now. Hey, welcome back. You're here to do some more Drake waggling. I'll tell you. You were quite a sight out there. Actually, I like to browse your wares. Well, I'm pretty sure I'd be missing a finger or two to those drakes if it wasn't for you. Browse all you like. Let's see. So he has... A rotten drake egg. Very nice. Sounds delicious. What's the deal with uh, you, fisherman? Welcome. Hmm, I love me some fish, but I could do with a drake kebab. Why do you say that? Well, I love the simple joy of fishing. Problem is, I know that drake are scaring off the best catches. Makes me so mad I could roast all of them alive and they have a big party. Fresh kebabs for all. You should do it. Yeah. Well, I would, but I've heard stories about drake brooders popping out of the water and devouring everything in sight. Suddenly, to get revenge. I don't want that kind of rage directed at me. Well, thank you for the information and goodbye there. Thanks to you, I managed to catch a whole bucket of crawfish today. That may not seem like much, but between the drakes and the scale, my brother and I have fallen on hard times. Now, thanks to your efforts, everything is turning out just fine. You're a real hero in my book, Fisherman Travis. You're welcome, sir. Now, Lord Farron sent me an email here that says, Greetings, old friend. As soon as you manage to drag your heroic behind out of that sickbed, your presence is requested, nay, demanded, back at our home in Divinity Reach. And if you come home without telling me that dazzling priestess of Duena, what a fine fellow I am, I will take it as a personal affront. Until we meet again, I remain your handsomest, most charming, and most humble companion, Lord Farron. Alright, we will not be going back to see my friend Lord Farron yet. Instead, uh, one of the things we're going to do is um, select some skills
Now these children here are the ones that want to know about Divinity, Divinity's Edge, Destiny's Edge, sorry. And um, can't help them yet, so I'm going past them. Water sounds great. I could sit here a little bit. And maybe we can find something good to eat. We got uh, cherry pies. Good. Stuffed zucchinis. Griffin eggs. Hmm, not sure about that. Orange coconut cake. Alright, so, so far the cherry pies and the cakes sound tasty. Uh, peach pie, that sounds good. Slice of cinnamon toast. It's kind of early in the morning, I suppose. I'll have a uh, toast. Yum, yum, yum. Alright. Time to get going. Hello there. Greetings. Your son joined the Sarah, didn't he? Yes, but I haven't heard from him in months. I'm worried sick. He's stationed in the old Ascalon settlement, isn't he? Yes. Last we heard, the centaurs were making a push down from the north. Next letter you send, tell them we're all very proud of him here in shame. Alright, so the village of Shamor is proud of that guy because he joined the Seraph. The Seraph are fighting against the centaurs protecting divinities. I am going to learn some skills. Kick. Push your foot back with a kick. Sounds interesting. Throw bolas. Throw bolas to immobilize your foe. Signet improves power. For great justice, grant fury and might to yourself and allies. Okay, we'll get that one. Shake it off. Cure a condition on yourself and nearby allies. Also breaks stuns. By that. One step closer to perfection. Yes, one step closer. Okay, what else we got? Banner of defense. Place a banner that increases toughness and vitality to yourself and allies. Berserker stance. Gain adrenaline for a short time. Conditions cannot be applied to you. Very interesting. Prayer to Kormir. Beseech Kormir to remove three conditions from you. Uh, Kormir is someone I helped uh, back before I came into this uh, time. Um, and Kormir used to be a regular old person, but she became a god. And, uh, here's a skill that besieges her to remove three conditions from you. So I'm going to learn that. Seeing that it might improve power, your attacks are unblockable. We'll go with that. And the banner of defense. Um, now, both charge. Charge your foe and knock down fleeting foes. That's excellent. Signet of Fury improves precision. Gain adrenaline. We'll buy that. Signet of Stamina grants faster endurance regeneration, cures all conditions. Get that. On my mark. Call out target foe to make them vulnerable. That's always very nice. So we'll get that couple banners here. Banner of Strength. Place a banner that improves your power and condition. Damage to your foe and allies. Banner of Discipline. Place a banner that improves precision and critical damage for you and nearby allies. 
endure pain, take no damage from attacks, you are still susceptible to conditions and control effects. I'm gonna Very get that easy. one. Prayer to Lisa. Lisa is one of the other gods, granting a random boon to yourself and a random condition to your target foe. So that's how it's done. Alright, so we'll do that. And then, um, for now, we'll, we'll select some of these skills. We'll put on uh, for great justice. Improve precision. And we'll work with the banners. So we'll go with that for now. Let's put the banner here. Go. Couple of merchants here. Fishmonger Zipio. Hello there. Hi there. Croft. Not sure. Cooked craw can. Cooked fish steak. I've eaten enough today. So we're gonna continue. Hello, villager. Okay, and uh, this is the trading post. There is a gentleman in Lion's Arch who owns a trader post. And we have an engineer. Um, guardian trainer. I'm a warrior. How about a warrior trainer? You got a warrior trainer around here somewhere? And we got Mesmer Trainer, Necromancer Trainer, Elementalist Trainer, Ranger Trainer. Ah, there's the Warrior Trainer. I missed him. So, Mr. Trainer, what could you possibly teach me, huh? Hello. Hello, Grell Keystone. Hello, stranger. Hi, stranger. I can sell you a trait manual or help you retrain your traits. Retrain your traits, sorry. Show me your manuals. Adept's training manual require level 11. Master training manual for one gold. Require level 40. Grandmaster's training manual for two da gold and require level 60. I'm just gonna go buy the 61. Yes. Thank you. Double click to use. This item will unlock the ability to spend up to 30 points in all trait lines and will refund your current spent trait points. This item can only be used once. Okay. So let's check out my traits. Um, right here, traits, we are going to go with 10 here, no, cannot spend any more points, wonder why, huh, Maybe I can't skip. Maybe I have to learn everything. Okay. Well, I'm back, so I'll just buy one of each. And good, there we are. Okay. 
Grandmaster, that's perfect. Okay, now let's see if we can do some of these traits. Gonna go ten here, and this makes a uh, reckless dodge. Damage falls at the end of a dodge roll. Uh huh. Very nice. And here we're gonna go with death from above. Damage and launch foes when you take falling damage. Take less damage from falling. Very useful. Restorative strength. Using a heal skill removes conditions. Uh, great fortitude. The percentage of power is giving us bonus to vitality. Gain might and adrenaline each time you are blocked. Damage is increased when wielding an axe, mace, or sword in your hand. Well, since I use a sword, I'm going to go with that. I'm using a sword for now. And arms. Let's see. This uh, increases precision and condition. I'm going to leave that alone. Increases toughness and healing. I'm uh, more of a damage dealer. I don't want to be a tank per se. So I'm going to skip that. And increase vitality and boon. Okay, I'm going to go with 10 on this one. Gain extra toughness per level while reviving. Oh, very nice. Okay, here we go. Banner apply their bonuses to a larger area. Reduces recharge on banners. I am using a banner, but I'm not really heavy on banners. So, empowered increases damage for every boon on you. This sounds good because this is a boon trait line. Leg specialist immobilize a target when you cripple them with a skill. Huh, I think my sword can cripple. Lung capacity reduces recharge on shouts. Oh, very nice. You deal additional damage while below the health threshold. Stronger bowstrings. Increase longbow range. Very nice. I have not yet equipped a bow. I'm gonna go with empowered. Increase damage for every boon. Very good. I put 10 here on discipline. Gain adrenaline on weapon swap. Excellent, but I haven't had uh, another weapon put on yet, so not useful yet. Uh, but we'll get there soon. Here we're going to go with uh, gain vigor when using a stance. No, 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 not that. Signet mastery. Signets recharge faster. Very useful. Mighty defense, you gain might when you block an attack. Okay, I'm not using any blocks really. Thrill of the kill, gain extra adrenaline on a kill, that's interesting. Warrior sprint, you move faster while wielding melee weapons. Um, kind of wielding melee weapons, but I already can run, I think. Yeah. Uh, with my horn. So, inspiring shouts. Gain adrenaline when using a shout. So, these uh, this two shot ones are interesting, but I'm gonna go with Signet Mastery. Signets recharge faster. I still have 22 points, but we're gonna get back to that later. So, for now, let's just Field of continue here. I'm just gonna go through the fields. Chop down a tree here. Because I need the trees for my crafting, which I learned. I learned a lot of crafting while I was recovering in Divinity. Now, 
there is a Captain Thackeray that is in the public service and uh, seeing him reminds me of when and Kieran Thackeray they got married and I was there for their marriage and Captain Logan Thackeray here today is in the public service just like they were so I think they would be very proud of him Hello, soldier. Hi, Tara. Okay. Pushing, we're pushing. We must hold the garrison at all costs. Very good, we're trying here. I'm sure we can do it. Almost ready. Come on. serious at all. I've defeated much tougher monsters in my time. This is nothing. Come on, Winky. that target. Come on over here, centaurs. Don't run away from me. Hundred blades for you, Tamini. Ha ha ha. Where do you think you're going? We're pushing, we're pushing. Come on, wing kick it up. <laughs> That's no fun. Uh oh, that was close. Do not die. For great justice. It'd be an embarrassing to die against the Taminis. Come on, where do you think you're going? There we go. You see, Seraph guys, push them back. Nothing to it. What's going on, Lieutenant? Like your helmet, sir. You require assistance. Uh -huh. I heard any rumors lately? Try that again. You're welcome. I don't normally gossip, but no, I really shouldn't say anything. You can tell me I won't say anything. 
Okay, but keep this quiet. You know I can't take bribes, ma'am. It's not a bribe. It's a thank you for keeping us safe. Then I'll share it with the others tonight. Thank you. Okay, but keep this quiet. One of my surgeons in the city saw Captain Thackeray exchanging intimate words with the Queen herself. If anyone asks, you didn't hear it from me. Well, how very interesting. So, Mr. Thackeray has a crush on the Queen, it would seem. Or they got something going together. Alright, I'll bite what is this place. Shamor Garrison, the last line of defense before Divinity's Reach. Why does Divinity Reach need to be defended? Don't you know? We're at war with the Centaurs. Why are we at war with the Centaurs? Centaurs are territorial. Lots of new changes lately have been threatening them. Even though I think there's plenty of room for all. Hmm. Not sure I agree with you. Let's see the color of the coin. Vigilance is key. Um, I um, like to know what sort of centaurs. Mostly Tamini. They've got camps southeast of here. We occasionally see centaurs from the other tribes, Harathi and Madnir. I guess they're banding together. That means this war isn't gonna end anytime soon. All right. See you later, Lieutenant. Well, I was saying how... When Thackeray might be proud of Captain Thackeray, but... Uh, you know, of his public service anyway, but I don't know about this deal he's got going with the Queen. I'm not sure she would approve of that. I don't really care personally. I would say good for the man. He aims high. How many centaurs do you think you've killed? I don't think. So we're at war now with the centaurs. Back when we were at war with the char. So I guess you're always at war with somebody. I wonder what became of the war with the char. Who won that war? I didn't go on. I wasn't there long enough to see it, so curious to find out what became of it and with that we are going to stop here till next time